Files Owner. In this section, we are going to see how to use Files Owner to connect elements added in the Interface Builder to its parent class. If we want to connect an Interface Builder file to a class, we have to make sure that the files owner of that Interface Builder file is connected to the class which we want to connect to. In this example, we can see that the files owner is connected to the View Controller class. This means that this Interface Builder is connected to the class View Controller. Next step is to ensure that the main view of the Interface Builder is connected to the view outlet of the files owner. If this connection is not there, then the view won't be displayed while the class is executed. Now open the interface file and create an outlet for UI button. Next open the interface builder file and add a button object to the main view. Now we have one button object in the interface builder and one button outlet in the interface file. Currently there is no relationship between these two items. If we want to link these two items, what we have to do is link the outlet link of the button object added in the interface builder file to the file's owner, which will have the outlet that we have created in the class interface file. We have to be really careful with this one. If we are not linking the main view in the interface builder file to the view of the file's owner, then the app will crash. In this example, Let's remove the link that is there for the main view of the Interface Builder. Now if we build and run the application, the application will crash as the main view in Interface Builder file is not linked to the view outlet in FileZoner.